Hey, what up, guys? Yoni the Game Changer here. And today, I've actually got a request on how to find the Death Claw Gauntlet for all of you melee players out there. Um, now, here's what we're going to have to do. This one actually requires a quest. It's not going to be just a quick, here's where you go to do it. But, this is actually going to be my first time finding it, too. So, we're going to go through this quest together. Now, what you're going to have to do is right here on the top right corner of the map, there's a place called the Museum of Witchcraft. And this is where we're going to have to go. Right here. This big giant cathedral looking thing. Now from what I've heard, it's actually kind of a creepy quest. So, <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Now, what you're going to notice is you can't get into the door. Because it's chained up. So what you're going to have to do is you run over to the right side of the church. Or the museum. And there's going to be a dead body right here on the floor. All torn up all over the place. And what you gotta do is take this guy's hollow tape. Now what we're gonna do is, as soon as you pick it up, you see the Devil's do. That's the quest that you have to have in order to get this. So let's go ahead and activate that quest. Listen to Private Heart's hollow tape. All right. So let us take a look at that hollow tape. Hold on, let's find it. I have way too much stuff in here. Um, right there. Jeffries, Lee got the recorder working. So this the sort of detail you had in mind when you signed up for the Gunners? Hauling luggage from Lynn Woods for some robot butler? Uh, what was his name? Uh, Wellington? <laughs> Wellingham? Not now, Private. Where's Carlos? He's not at his post. Oh, uh, sorry, sir. The lieutenant said he found some tracks. Wanted to check them out. Private Martin. Tracks? What track? What the hell is that? Oh my. Connor! Where, where's the rest of him? Jesus. Aldous. Sergeant Lee grabbed the case. Do not let that thing out of your sight. Everyone inside the museum, now! Major! Major, what found us? Oh shit! Right, so I hope you guys could have heard that, could hear that, okay? But <clears throat> sounds like they got into a little bit of trouble. So let's go ahead and go in the museum and check it out. Okay, so we gotta start in the basement. All right, so let's go on in here. Okay, now if I scream like a little girl, I apologize because I heard there's a few jump scares in this quest. So don't hold it against me. Uh oh. That doesn't sound good. Let's get this little... Sorry, I always have to explore literally everything, so... Oh, good. Okay, now let's see what just made that nasty... Oh, God. Something's making some kind of nasty sound that I don't really like. Oh, shit. Okay. I think... I mean, since the quest is for the Death Claw Gauntlet, it's probably going to be a big ass Death Claw that we have to fight. So let's just go on over here. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> well done on the the sound effects. All right. Let's follow this all the way up to the top. Oh shit! <laughs> Woo! All right. Probably shouldn't be playing this in the dark. All right, let's take these. Anything good? I hate mannequins. All right. Come up here. So, from what I read, we have to basically get to the very, very top of the building. Um, and then continue from there. Oh, jeez. Did you open that by yourself? Because I didn't open that. I really hate mannequins, guys. I don't know if you know that, but I'm really not a fan. And there's mannequins all over the place here. I don't like this place. Alright. So we gotta go this way. Oh, shit. There is a big ass death claw. Woo! 
That's not good. Ow. Oh shit. Ran out of ammo. Hold on. Alright. Come on, dog meat. Get him. This is also on the survival difficulty, so if I die, I apologize. Which I don't think I will. I think we'll be okay. Yeah, I just gotta get out of this corner. There we go. Alright. This guy is done for. Yeah! <laughs> Savage Death Claw down! Oh, sorry. Let me heal you up. Sorry, dog meat. Okay. I'm just gonna take all his stuff. Alright, now where do we have to go? Let's keep going back over here. Ooh, lots of ammo. I already have a 50 caliber sniper, so I don't want it. Now, if you guys don't know, um, and I'll make a separate video about this if you guys have any questions, but you see on the name how there's like a little magnifying glass on the side of the name of the items? If you're missing any items when you're trying to craft things, there's a way that you can um, set it up so it'll identify them. So instead of just being like a normal item, you see how it's got kind of a, like a yellow glow around it? You can set it up so it's easier to find stuff that you're looking for. So if you guys want to know how to do that, let me know in the comments down below and I'll make a separate video about it. Oh, there's another dude that's torn into pieces. Alright. There's the other hollow tape that we have to get. Let me take that egg. Okay, so that pristine, the one that said pristine deathclaw egg, you have to take that one. So make sure you pick that up, okay? Now we have to listen to, what's the next part of the quest? Listen to Sergeant Lee's hollow tape. All right. So Sergeant Lee, hollow tape. All right, let's hear it. Nest full of death claw eggs. A dozen, maybe more, smashed to bits. Except this one. No wonder they would tell us what was in that case. If I knew, I would have personally told the gunner bosses. And that glorified liquor cabinet dwelling him to take those diamond seed caps and stuff them. I guess we know why that death claw tracked us all the way from Lynn Woods now. We stole their damn kids. Christ. Maybe. Maybe if we just return the eggs. Oh, hey, Mama. You looking for this? So I guess now we know why they all died. <laughs> okay, now here's the important part. Um, now that you're up here, if you look at the quest, it says either complete the delivery of the egg or return the egg to his nest. If you want the Deathclaw Gauntlet, you actually have to return it to the nest. So we're going to have to go find the nest and return it. All right, now let's see. How do we get out of here? Okay, now we can unchain the front door. Okay, so remember, return the egg. So now we gotta go find the nest for that death claw, and we gotta go return this egg. That jump scare where the body fell out of this, the top of the room actually scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Let's just pick up all this stuff, unchain that door. Alright, now we're back out here. Okay, so if we're looking to look at our map. Um, there's two places we can go. Either down here to Diamond City to complete the delivery, or we can come up here to this top part that says return the egg to its nest. And that's where we're going to go. So let's head over to that top. Alright, let's head on. I'm actually going to just fast travel. What's the closest? This is the closest place that I can see. Oh, I guess I haven't discovered that place either. Um... Let's just run... Alright, we'll go from here. So I don't know if that made you guys jump, <laughs> but it definitely made me jump. Um, and the parts where the holotape are playing, I hope you guys could hear the sound okay. Um, I tried to play it up so that Mike could pick it up, but... I feel bad for those guys. That death claw tracked them down there and just slaughtered literally every single person working that job. So that sucks for them. Alright, so let's run all the way up here. Maybe we'll run into some more enemies and get some more action. Um, when you get to this top spot, um, to the Deathclaw's Nest, there's actually going to be a big-ass Deathclaw right here. 
but it's not going to attack you. Um, so just uh, we got to get across this little river. Um, I'm actually just gonna I'm gonna jetpack over. Um, but you know, so you're gonna find a, a big old death claw, but it's not gonna be hostile. Um, so don't shoot it. <laughs> These little shits, though. Oh, there's a legendary. Let's see what we get from this guy. Was there more? Oh. Oh, shoot. That actually didn't kill it. Alright, let's... Whoops. Let's take out this legendary over here. Alright, and he's out. Let's see what legendary weapon we got from him. Quick draw, automatic... Ooh, awesome. Cost 25 less action points. I'll probably just turn that into a... Um... My main plasma rifle. Cool, I'll take it. Alright, so let's get across this... River here. Almost made it all the way across. Oh, there's another one right here. So I'm just gonna get out of this river over here. Let's take out this guy. Alright, he's out. Okay, now let's go deliver this egg. We're gonna run right over here. And just remember, don't shoot the death claw. Because it's not gonna be hostile. Okay, it seems like we're pretty close. Let's run right up here. Oh shit. Oh, there's the death claw. See, and it's not attacking me. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna run right up here. We're gonna deliver the egg. Just hit A to return it. And let's see what happens. Where'd that death claw go. I don't know where the death claw went, but it didn't attack me, so we're good. Okay, now after you return the egg, here's this little pile. Now if you look just to the left of it, the death claw gauntlet's gonna be right there. So just pick that up. And boom, now we've got the Death Claw Gauntlet. Let's take a look at it real quick. Whoa, I don't know where I'm going. Weapons. Death Claw Gauntlet. Nice, look at how badass that looks. Now, with me picking it up, I don't have any perks into um, melee weapons. So, it's 55 damage with 75 value. Which, I mean, for not having any perks, perk points into it, it's actually not bad. Um... I'm sure if you have some points into it, it would be pretty good. I've seen it all the way up to almost close to 100 unupgraded, so it's pretty good. Let's actually head over to our workbench, and let's see what we can upgrade this into. Um, I've never picked this up before, so let's see how it goes. So just remember, when you get there, don't shoot that Death Claw, otherwise it's going to attack you, and the less Death Claws you have to fight, the better. Um, I've run into a few albino Death Claws, and those things are no joke. They're brutal. Um, especially on survival difficulty, where you basically do like no damage to anything. <laughs> Even with my fully upgraded weapons, as you can see, it, on that last death claw, it took me quite a little while to actually take it down. Which, the longer you take, and I've got fully upgraded power armor, so that's why it, I didn't take as much damage. But it could have been worse. Okay, so let's check this out. So let's get out of this power armor so that we can actually upgrade this. Come on over here. Alright, so Death Claw Gauntlet. Ooh, we can do an extra claw. Oh, that's badass. Look at how cool that looks. And again, that upgrades it to 65 for me, but I don't have any perks in a melee, so it, for you guys it would probably be even better. That is so cool. Look at how sick that looks with three claws. That is awesome. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, well that's how you guys get the Death Claw Gauntlet. I had a few requests for it, so I hope the video was everything you guys needed to be able to find it. If you have any questions on the quest, um, or if you get stuck anywhere, just let me know in the comments down below, please. Um, if you guys liked the video, if it helped you at all, please like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. I really, help, I really hope all of you guys enjoyed it and that you guys were able to find this okay. Um, once more, this is Yanni the Game Changer. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.